So we've got our music here, and what we want to do is we want to take the first two pages. We're going to take the first two, get everything else out of the way. And you want to lay them out in order. So first page, second page. And then you want to flip them over together so that they stay in the right order. Like that. See what we did there? Now, the next thing you want to do is get about a hair's width between them. Any more, and the tape will stick to things that it's not supposed to stick to. Any less, and the pages won't fold flat. And you want to get your tape. You want to hold the two pages in place with one hand and put the tape carefully in the middle. Now everything's nice and stable. You don't have to hold it anymore. And you want to put a piece on the bottom and you want to put a piece on the top. And if you've done everything right, this should fold nicely and flat. See that? So now you've got the first two pages done. You turn it around. You get the third page. And now you're going to tape it on the forward side. Last time we taped it on the back side. Now we're going to tape it on the forward side. Okay. Got that hair's width between. Hold it steady and put a piece of tape in the middle. And then one on the top, one on the bottom. Oops. Okay. Got one there on the bottom and one up the, on the top. Now we're going to get page four. And we're going to go back to what we did for the very first two pages. We've got these pages in order. This is three and four. We're going to flip the whole thing together so that they stay in order. And we can fold these to get them out of our way. I'm going to hold them with one hand. Put that piece of tape down the middle. And then one on the top, one on the bottom. So I think by now you see what I'm doing. I'm alternating taping on the front, taping on the back, taping on the front, taping on the back, always making sure that the pages stay in order. If you're taping on the back side, you have to flip everything together. If you're taping on the front side, you don't need to flip. And that's it. You can do this with a three-page three piece of music or 50 pages. There you go. Now you've got something that's going to stand up easier on the piano and folds up very nicely to take it with you.